Paul and Jess, five different police officers are now on routine leave because of these shootings. And the department tells me all of this is a little unusual and also a little scary. A busy week of officer involved shootings throughout Oklahoma City. It's very unique. Leaving some in the department concerned about recent actions by armed suspects. In all three of these cases that have happened, they've been confronted with weapons, and that's really concerning. Yesterday evening, the department responded to their third police shooting in just five days. After they say this man, 40 year old Jonathan Boyd, who they were investigating for beating a woman, charged at them armed with a knife. I've here nine years, and I've never seen anything like this. Boyd survived and is recovering at a local hospital before he will be transferred to jail. On Sunday night, police say this man, Hayden Taylor, also charged at an officer with a knife and was shot and killed. And a few hours before that, police say Todd Heenan shot at three officers, hitting one in a taser before he was eventually shot. Right now, it does seem like there's a trend of that going on. Now, police say there is body camera footage in all of these cases, and that body camera footage will eventually be released. Reporting live downtown tonight, Jonathan Coop, KOCO 5 News.